Today, we're gonna unbox and review the RUN smart treadmill sensor made by North Pole Engineering. Hi, I'm Coach Duckworth, and on this channel, we're going to cover everything triathlon, from gear reviews to racing and training strategies to help you cross the finish line faster and more confident. So if you haven't already, support this channel and subscribe. Here is the uh, Run Smart Treadmill Sensor. It came in just a basic box, and we open it up here. We've got some thank you, tell your family and friends, contact information card. We've got the actual run sensor. This is actually the first time I'm opening it, so um, we'll kind of mess around with this. And this little protection there. It looks like it's a four-step start. And, uh, underneath that, we've got the start guide. We've got the charger, it looks like. And then we've got, I assume these to um, keep stuff, sticky stuff on the treadmill. And then I do recognize these. You put this on the actual treadmill belt and that's what recognizes the speed of the treadmill. So that is all the stuff that comes in the box. Let's set it up. Okay, now that we've got the Run Smart treadmill sensor set up, let's go into Zwift. I'll show you how to pair it here. Click into my profile. Then you're going to select at the top of Run. And then you're going to search for the Run. Select it. You're going to do the cadence. And then if you have a heart rate monitor, you can connect that. Press OK. Oops, I accidentally pressed uh, before the screen, but that's OK. We're, we're just connecting here. So I'm just on the uh, track now. I'm going to start my treadmill up. <clears throat> now, if you're not on your treadmill, it's going to just sense that you're running. So that's a, something you have to keep in mind is that if you get off, you got to press stop or your guys is going to keep running. And you're not actually running. So um, I'm going to turn this up here. And I've already tested this out. Uh, I absolutely love this. It's 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 super accurate. Um, you do still have to kind of know your treadmill because the treadmills aren't accurate. Um, so when you calibrate it, calibrating is kind of a science in the regards that uh, you know some treadmills are slow, some treadmills are fast. But the main thing is this thing is consistent. It stays connected, and it's awesome to run with. So I highly highly suggest it. Um, I'll go ahead and put a link up where you can buy the uh, run treadmill sensor from us directly. And if you have any questions or concerns, let me know. And uh, look forward to helping you guys enjoy your run. So, overall thoughts. I love it. I did a review on the uh, Garmin, Garmin watch where I showed how to run with the Garmin watch. Unfortunately, and probably user error, I haven't had much luck um, calibrating this to the run speed. And so I feel that the run, just doing this quick run, has been awesome. It adjusts to the treadmill um, easily, and it's just far more um, accurate and easy than the Garmin watch at this point. And again, that could just be user error. So, Highly recommend the run. Um, doesn't take much time to set up, as you saw. Super easy. I think it's just a matter of turning it on and pairing it. 
and uh, enjoying your treadmill run on, on Zwift. Anyways, I hope you like this. If you want to see more videos like this, uh, please support this channel. I'm going to put a link down below where you can actually buy a run that will support this channel. And of course, always uh, subscribe, like, and comment on this video. Share it with your friends. Have a good day. Happy training. Mm -hmm.